That's a 70% vaccination rate that is part of a plan for normalcy this summer. But for some businesses, it's a little too late. The pandemic killed them. Sure did, but during this uh, time, some new ones also opened up and stayed open. ABC 6 News reporter Miguel Octavio went to visit some of them again. Miguel, how did uh, these businesses manage to survive? Well, Laura and Ross, this was about creativity in their business. They could not prepare for the pandemic's punishment. They could only adjust, and it paid off. As COVID-19 cases ease and restrictions in Minnesota are set to lift even more tomorrow night, they're keeping their hopes up. Off of Highway 52 in Pine Island, they're serving drinks. It's the new South by Southeast Brewing Company. Pandemic or not, it opened last fall. We didn't even know what we were up against. We just figured we have to open and start cash flow at some point because it's a business. Six weeks later, though, a new wave of COVID cases shut it down, laying off staff. That was difficult. It was a hard conversation to call everybody and say, I'm sorry, but when we're open, we'll call you back. But co owner Ann Fahey Gust refused to give up. She's been brewing for 30 plus years now. She wasn't letting one pandemic kill what she loves most. It forced to be really creative, and that's one thing we're good at. She and co owner Tessa Learn got to work rethinking beer distribution, pushing to go in online sales, and making use of outdoor seating. And I think confidence is coming back. Kathleen Harrington says it's that entrepreneurial spirit that kept and will keep businesses alive. At cause or require those entrepreneurs in the hospitality sector to be innovative. But Ann and Tessa say it was also overwhelming support from shopping local and the business community. You got through with a lot of really great people around you helping you. There's a lot of restaurant people that are much closer and we're probably better for that now. They're not sure what the summer will bring, but they'll be ready. They already made it this far. Shop local and innovation are key here. Now, Kathleen Harrington, though, says financial recovery will be uneven across different sectors of business. But post pandemic, we may see more businesses open up. Harrington says that could be from low interest rates if they stay low, more commercial property, and the need for more workers. Lauren Ross.